Hello, you beautiful people. Uh, welcome to the channel. It's Rad. And uh, in today's video, uh, we are going to look into the 19th of uh, September 2022, uh, which happens to be Monday, and uh, see what kind of a day we all are going to have through the eyes of Tarot. And uh, if you are interested uh, to have a personal reading with me, you can check out the description down below, and there you are going to see a link to my website. Uh, in which at the very front page you're going to see full list of my services also their pricing and you can go for whichever service suits you best uh, based on your budget and as well you need so with that said let's uh, pretty much do the cut and uh, see what we have for the day uh, now the first one for the day that's going to be the two of uh, the two of pentacles uh, followed by the second card of the day, which uh, stands as the Five of Wands. Uh, that's uh, very interesting here. It's the Five of Wands, yeah. And the final one. It's oh, that now that makes sense. So the final one that's going to be uh, the Moon card, All right? And uh, we do have uh, those uh, those three cards, and this is how the elemental dignity of the day uh, pretty much stands. All right, this is going to be a bit stressful day, and I'm saying a bit stressful day. Hopefully, what the information I'm going to give you, give you is going to ease you up, because usually when uh, you go through something like that, uh, and more emotional people, they start, they tend to start believing into the doom and gloom, which is which they couldn't be far further off the truth with that. So, the main topic of the day. Uh, our plans and things, um, they are not going to develop the way we plan them to develop, but they are going to develop the way they are supposed to develop, okay? And that is literally the breaking point. What I mean is that uh, when things doesn't develop the way we planned uh, and we are very emotional about them, then we start believing into the doom and gloom, right? But they will, like I said, develop exactly the way they are supposed to develop. And at the end of the road, which is not going to be at 19th of September, it may be in a couple of months, uh, it may be in a couple of years, depending on what kind of an enterprise is set to be established today. Uh, we are going to be grateful that actually the development of that particular day, if we can recall it, you know, if we can evoke the memory of it, uh, didn't turn out the way we, uh, we planned it to uh to happen so uh that said we can expect a lot of gaps uh, within the day a lot of time gaps within the day itself no different than uh, you have scheduled a meeting with a co-worker of yours but it turns out that they are stuck in traffic so that meeting drops off and you pretty much are left hanging you have nothing to do um, for an hour and a half well you have nothing to do by your plan but you can adapt Okay, you can you can let go of uh, of these of certain concepts of yours, which happens to be outdated for the given situation. Readopt new concepts and just fill up time with something different. You can learn something. You can undertake some kind of another task. Uh, and I'm saying the concepts because I'm like that. I mean, when I set something and it's not happening, it's just I'm happening to stare at the wall and I'm do I do nothing else. Uh, whichever the case, guys. Two of Pentacles, it's a card showing that if you do go by your strict plans, okay, and you are not adaptable, you are not agile and able to uh, kind of like uh, shift and swing and, and, and re-adopt a line, different stuff on the places as the opportunity presents, then things are not going to be experienced in the best way possible. However, if you are willing to let go of outdated um standards concepts ideas goals for the given situation then you will have an, an amazing experience seeing uh, a, a difference in the plan instead of a setback as an opportunity an opportunity is going to be having that five of ones next to the two of pentacles is pretty much points that there are these surprising events where there, is, there are going to be a gaps of our plans they are going to be very, very neutral. They are neither going to be good or bad. They are going to be exactly as we make them. And uh, I hope that we do, all of us, have the awareness to make them as best as we can. However, um, 
the grand scheme of things which is shaping up we doesn't have we don't have to like it but that is not going to change that something is going to start cooking up and we will have a pretty good idea what but we are not going to be able to tell uh, exactly yet and uh, that is something one or another way we will have to go through we will have to endure and uh, today's uh, today's cards are also a clear sign that whatever choices we made especially if you watch uh, Sunday's um, uh, daily reading uh, we should not deviate from those choices even if things did not went exactly as planned from Sunday to Monday so with that said oh uh, one last thing I forgot to mention, it, it will be normal throughout the day to feel emotionally uncertain and insecure. That is because there are going to be circumstances we couldn't tell why those circumstances are forming. And that's pretty much the reason, because if we can tell why we can change them and we're not supposed to change them. Like I said, we are destined to go somewhere and that destiny begins today. Okay, 19th of September, 2022nd. So with that said, uh, this is the Daily Tarot Guidance. Hopefully you do enjoy, enjoyed it and you do like it, guys. And we're going to see each other next time. Until then, bye.